I chose the MICAP program at the University of Minnesota because I knew that I wanted to do research in cancer and immunology, and it made sense to pick a program that really encompassed those fields. The other reason I picked the MICAP program is because of the collaborative and interdisciplinary nature of the research that's being done. One thing that really attracted me to this program was the faculty are really approachable, they're really friendly. You are treated as a colleague who's part of the community. You are a major driver of research in the lab, so ultimately you discuss science and it's a partnership. I personally, I see myself becoming a principal investigator and running my own lab, and I feel like that has been a priority from the administration and the faculty in the program, and they're invested in helping me achieve that goal. The facilities and the resources on the University of Minnesota campus are excellent. So the majority of labs that a MICAB student would end up in are on a part of campus called the Biomedical Discovery District. And those buildings are all quite new and the lab spaces are really top notch. One of the biggest strengths are the core facilities that graduate students and labs can use. So an example of that would be the flow cytometry core, the imaging core, and the genomics core, where you can get help on your projects and really branch out your research. So Minneapolis, the one thing I really like is that the people are quite warm in spite of the fact that the weather is cold. Coming from Colorado to the Twin Cities was a big adjustment, but I think if there's one thing that's my favorite thing so far about the Twin Cities, it's the food. The restaurants here are fantastic, and my girlfriend and I are big foodies, and we've really enjoyed it so far. I like to bike, I like to hike, I like to ski, and I feel like I can do that really easily here. So the community of students in the MICAB program is really strong, and I think the strength lies in the small class sizes. I also think the relationship between classes in the MICAB program is really strong as well. I felt a lot of support from the upperclassmen, and I in turn feel you know, like I can pay that forward to incoming students. The MICAB community is very tight-knit, and they've really become like a second family to me. You know, you, there are times when your research isn't working um, and there are challenges that you're facing. And so having that community of students that are going through some of the same things and are able to give you advice has been really good for me to kind of keep that motivation to keep going. 